Welcome back to my channel and if you're new to my channel go ahead and hit the subscribe button to see more home holiday event wedding and DIY decor today I'm gonna show you how to make a dress form baby shower centerpiece and set up here we go this baby shower centerpiece because I am giving my dress form a baby bump. Let's get started. <laughs> All right guys, so I'm going to get started by grabbing a small nail from inside my picture hanging kit. I'm not sure where I got this kit from, but I believe it's from um, Dollar Tree. If not, I probably got it from Home Depot, but um, you can get this kit pretty much anywhere. And the nail is about, um, two inches long and it's pretty thin okay and what I'm going to do with this nail is I'm going to <laughs> poke her belly oh my god that sounds so bad I'm going to poke the belly so then I can grab my half ball my foam ball my half foam ball and I'm going to push it against the nail so it can stay there but I'm also going to add some hot glue around there so it can um, you know secure it a little more okay so it will look something like that gonna apply a little glue around the nail to secure it next I'm going to be using this blue stretchy material that I got from Hobby Lobby uh, this is a quarter of a yard um, you don't even need that much uh, it was only a dollar forty so I really didn't like spend a lot of money on it but um, you can get whatever color you like. If you want it for a girl, you're obviously going to use pink or you can use green or purple, whatever color you like, but just make sure that it's stretchy. And I'm going to bring it all around. The only thing that I was worried about, it was that it was a little short, but um, I'm gonna be able to stretch it. So that's gonna be all right. And I'm just going to glue it back here. I'm going to uh, place the rough edges, you know, first, and then I will place the nice edge over it. as possible she is trying to show some boobies and I'm trying to keep her up all right so I'm going to add a little glue right here so this one roll down and I'm able to see her boobies so just really lightly So far, so good. Look how cute she looks. So pretty. All right. Now, I'm going to continue 
uh, by glue and the bottom so it can look smoother see a couple of creases there I'm going to smooth that out by um, gluing the dress to the bottom of the form Next, I'm going to add some glue to the middle as well, and I'm going to bring this side over. And it should look something like this. You can decide whether to leave it as it is, or you can cut it off. I haven't decided yet what I'm going to do, because I have something that I'm going to put over it. I'm most likely going to cut it off, and I'm going to place something down the middle to cover it up. Um, or I might just leave it on. I don't know. I kind of like it. Next, I'm going to use this tool uh, princess skirt that I found at Dollar Tree. I am going to place it over her belly as a skirt. Um, so I'm just going to pull it off. And I'm going to actually cut it open a little bit because it's a little bigger than what I need. So there's this... Uh, middle part here where they sort it together. So you're just going to cut that open. Then you're going to place the skirt over her belly. As so. If you find that um, your tool is a little wrinkled, try to iron it before so um, it won't look, you know, bad and tacky. So I decided to keep this. I'm just going to trim the bottom. I'm just going to add a little glue there. Now I'm going to trim the tool right here down the middle just to make it a little neater. Now I'm going to glue it together again. Yep, nice. Okay, so since I decided to keep this little train thing here, I am going to cut it off a little bit. That belly is not letting me do too much. <laughs> Just like when you're pregnant, huh? Can do everything you want. Um, so I'm going to cut this. And I'm just going to glue it down. And here is how it's looking like right now. It's not the prettiest sight, but um, it's totally secure there. Now I'm going to add a vase to my pregnant um, girl here. <laughs> I don't know what to call her yet. And um, I'm going to use this clear salad plate because this is pretty light and it will fall over if somebody, you know, um, leans against the table or bumps the table. So I'm going to add this plate so it can be, to be a little more solid. Okay, so it's gonna look something like that. And I'm going to be using hot glue for now because I'm doing this in front of you. But if you want this to be really secure, Go ahead and use E6000. It takes 24 hours to bond, but that's your best bet, okay? Now you're going to grab your second tool skirt, and you are going to grab the longer part of it, which is the under part. And you are going to, let me see, there you go. And you are going to grab the ribbon part of the skirt and you are going to glue it all around the uh, top of the dress all right as so all right and you're gonna go as far back as you can
So I'm just going to add a little glue right there. Make sure not to add glue to the, uh, the dress form, just to the dress. goodness guys I am so sorry I did not realize my camera wasn't recording the next step and ah, I am so mad about it but here's what you have to do all you have to do is cut off the excess tool and pull the tool together and glue it's basically the same step as you did with the bottom of the dress next I'm going to add a couple of rows of diamond wrap from Dollar Tree I'm going to add it right on top of the rubber band as a belt. Now I'm going to make her a nice necklace with two rows of diamond wrap. And I'm just going to Bring it together here in the middle okay so she is very fabulous and very wealthy so she can't afford this big big necklace of diamonds around her neck all right she's just gonna add glue right there in the middle And then you're just going to add a little bit of hot glue to the back to secure it. And here she is looking lovely and delicate as ever. <laughs> I love it. Um, I did wanted to mention that I changed the base of the centerpiece for a totally clear salad plate also from Dollar Tree instead of the one with the designs. And I think this is a better choice because it looks much more polished. Hey guys, this is it. This is my baby shower centerpiece and I absolutely love it. I love this centerpiece. How cute is she pregnant? She is so cute. I just got her married and now she's having a baby. <laughs> uh, I still have to make the groom. So I don't know how she got pregnant without the groom, but the groom is coming. I promise. Um, yeah, I totally love it. The only thing I will tell you to be aware of is the glue on the side. Um, it was totally a no-no. So I will suggest for you to wait to add that glue once you place the second tool uh, for the ribbon on top of the dress. So I will add the glue then to keep the bottom dress up. So like that you will camouflage it with the uh, ribbon so yeah that's the only thing I wish I would have done different but other than that I love it I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please make sure to give me a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet do so right now also if you know of someone that will love and can use this centerpiece make sure to share with them at the end of this video share 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 sharing is caring <laughs> also leave me a comment let me know what you thought of this centerpiece and leave me a comment anyway because this girl right here love to chit chat with you guys all the time until next time bye